All right, Matt, Mark, Carolina Varsity here with North Mac head coach Eric Mormon. Uh, coach, talk to me a little bit about your background and where you came from. Um, coach, uh, well, I played over at uh, Richmond Senior High School um, where I played for Ed Emery um, and Coach Hoggart. Um, then, you know, I moved on from there and had an opportunity to move on to Catawba College to play under Coach Hester. Uh, and after leaving Catawba College, I moved on over to A.O. Brown High School where I worked under Mike Newsom as a defensive back coach. And, and, and after leaving after leaving A.O. Brown, I went to West Stanley to work under James Johnson, a former coach from Richmond County where he was a defensive coordinator. And, and, and then eventually I've been, I had the opportunity to become the head coach there at West Stanley. Yes, sir. Great. So what made you take the uh, the North Meg position when it came open? Um, it was a great opportunity. Um, you know, North Meg traditionally has had you know, has had great tradition, and um, you know, I, you know, it was just a great opportunity for me and my family to get here at North Mac. Um, and, and, and so far, you know, everything is going great. Excellent, excellent. Uh, talk to me a little bit about how you want to build this program and uh, your definition of a good um, high school football program. Um, well, well, it's great. I've been around really, you know, I've had opportunity to play for and you also work at some traditional great high schools and great programs. And the things we're looking for here, are we're going to set high expectations to where, you know, the players, the coaches, everybody in the program, the community, they all know what they expect. Um, and, and also, you know, we're going to set high standards. And the goal for all of our coaches is to make sure that we hold all of our guys accountable. Um, you know, going on from there, I would say, you know, coaching stability. You know, mm -hmm. having your core group of coaches that constantly are going to be there in that program. And, and, and we're all working up toward that one goal. And the things that we talk about here are, you know, just being uncommon. It means pretty much doing the right things, that, you know, whenever nobody's around, you know, just doing the right things at all times. Um, and, and we constantly preach that every single day. And then we just try to set our priorities straight by making sure that we believe in, we, go to, we talk to the kids about family, education, mm -hmm. and football. And we, and, and we, you know, we just structure our program around that. Excellent, excellent, so. Coach. Uh, talk me a little bit what your offense and defense are going to look like uh, this year. Um, offensively, you know, we're, we're going to spread you out, and, and um, we're uh, obviously we have Emmanuel Wilson, uh, one of our running backs, and you know, yeah. we have a good core group of running backs, and you know, we, we want to run the football. Um, but um, one of the things that we've been working on a lot this spring and the summer is, you know, just find an opportunity with different ways to get our guys in space, and we're going to let them make plays. Mm -hmm. um, so we're excited about that. Um, and then defensively, um, I've had our defensive coordinator Ryan Red. Um, he's been doing an outstanding job. Um, we're glad to have him, um, mm -hmm. and, and and you know we're going to be uh, four two five defensively. Okay. And, you know, uh, you know, I think you know it'd be very exciting to watch. We have a lot of returning guys on that side of football. Excellent, excellent. So you mentioned Emmanuel Wilson. Uh, a little more about those uh, standout players you're expecting to have a big year for you guys. Yes, um, definitely. Uh, Emmanuel Wilson is one. He's, he's, he plays a little bit of running back for us, and um, you know the, the big thing is I think a lot of guys will be surprised how good of a defensive player he is. And, we're excited about watching a little bit over there this year. Okay. Um, we have Jamonte Bird, one of our defensive tackles. Mm -hmm. uh, he's been having, he's had, he had an awesome spring. Um, he, he's been one of the guys step up in leadership for us. Um, then Tavian Bird, is another guy that plays outside linebacker for us. Um, he played a little bit of offense last year. Um, he's he's another guy that's been you know stepping out in that leadership role that we're expecting big things from. And and, and then um, obviously we have you know we're just going to compete all over the board with a lot of our athletes, but. You know, Aaron Scott is one of the guys right now competing at quarterback for us. And, okay. You know, he's a very exciting, exciting young man to watch and, and, and very athletic and also can throw the football. And so, you know, we've been working with him a lot. And, you know, I think, you know, he'll have a good year this year. Excellent. Excellent. Uh, last question, Coach. What What's the team goal for this North Mac Viking team uh, this season? Uh, team goal is, we're you know, we're going to take one day at a time uh, and, and one game at a time. Okay. And, and, and that's our focus. Um, we, we take it from there. We focus on that one thing, that one win. We try to win each and every day. Mm -hmm. And that's our goal. Excellent, man. Well, we definitely appreciate the time. I've heard good things about you. We look forward to seeing you on the field. Yes, sir. I'm glad you stopped by. Glad to have you. Yes, sir. We appreciate all that you do. Thank you. Yes, sir.